So now I'm going to stain the patient with a combined stain of 1% fluorescein and lysamine green. Never use 2% fluorescein on a dry eyed patient because it just won't fluoresce and you'll have to add saline to see anything. So I'm just going to put in this combined stain. You can definitely see how dry this patient is by this green stain. Uh, she's staining beautifully with lysamine green now and also in the nasal area and you can also see that she's fairly hyperemic as well and of course redness and dryness are linked so the drier you go the more hyperemic you become and so a lot of the computer users have pink eye by the end of the day if they've spent 12 hours on the computer because their eyes are so dry in central heating or air conditioning and not blinking. This is a dry eyed patient but occasionally patients will tell you that their eyes itch. Now in a hay fever season, how do you know if it's a dry eye itch or a hay fever itch? This is dry eye staining. This is hay fever staining. There's a big difference between these small, tiny little stains with lysamine green and these larger areas with the conjunctival folds of dryness.